Okay, back again. Um, just want to kind of quickly go over what I'm working on today. Um, today, I actually can see I got the exhaust manifold on. Um, to do this properly, you got to make sure you do it in the right bolt order, and then it's in the factory service manual of how you should be um, kind of what what order you should be put, uh, putting these on. There was a really nice metal gasket that actually came with the um, exhaust manifold, so I got that on. Um, I did actually. There's only three bolts or nuts and with the studs that actually came with the exhaust manifold and I actually replaced those ones really simple but these top ones they're exactly the same so I don't know why I only came with three um, but I just, I just reuse those other ones that should be okay got them all torqued down correctly and I want, kinda want to show you what I'm actually referencing off of when I use my kinda, when I'm torquing stuff down so I actually got a board a kind of a cork board big big old board that I use and I actually put in all the exploded views of the engine right here and it's really nice because they actually have all the torque values that you're supposed to be putting those putting these uh each bolt at so i kind of wanted to show you what ones i just did for the exhaust manifold so if he, i can zoom in for this it's right here you can see there's there's three values um excuse me right here this one right here um you can see that it's there's three like crazy numbers there you don't really know what it is um one thing you want to kind of key off of is the um white wrench with a black background keep an eye on that because when you go to the key right here you can see the white wrench black background the first value is the newton meters the next one is the uh kilograms per meter and the next one's foot pounds since we're in america i'm using the foot pounds um so if you look that's the third value in there so if you look back over here the third value there is 21 to 24.6 foot pounds of torque that you're supposed to put onto the um those specific bolts for the exhaust manifold. Um, yeah, so it's, it's remember it's loosening, loosen and tighten in the correct order. So I did uh, put those on there at about around 23. I, I like to kind of be right in the middle. But um, this is really handy to have all these explode views and not just to, in the book itself because you keep having to flip back and forth to it. Another thing I did was um was the the manual actually states. And um, I should have, I didn't really look over, I kind of overlooked this, but um, now going back to this, I want to make sure I get it up set correctly. Was that the washers that come with the cylinder bolts, they actually are kind of camfered on one side, if you look right here. And then there's a super flat side, and then there's a little camfer on, on the top. You got to make sure that you get those set correctly. I don't know why, but I'm going to do it anyways because the manual says it. Um, I actually, um, I did flip them all for the other ones, so I noticed that a few were incorrect, so I made it correct. But then one of the ones that I actually can't remove, this actually this one right here, um, I actually had it flipped on the wrong side. The other one was fine, but this one I forgot. Or I actually didn't look at the manual first, and I didn't have it. So um, I removed all of the the nuts again. I loosened the nuts at least. Just kind of shifted this back, and I was able to get this bolt out. Flipped the washer and did. Uh, did it properly this time. Th these are still in here. Um, I'm just going to leave it in for my reference of where stuff needs to go. But overall, um, I think this is pretty successful. Um, honestly, I'm pretty sure this one, this head, is ready to go back on the engine. Um, I'm I'm really kind of satisfied with the way it's progressed. I do have not I've not put the exhaust manifold on the other one. I've not put the bolts in the other one. I actually haven't put these two like really hard bolts to get in yet um, on the other one yet. But I'm I'm gonna do those right now. And I might be actually having my friend come over today to um, help me get the uh, heads back on. Um, so who knows? But in the day I might actually have these heads on and actually in my opinion is the turning point for reassembly of really trying to get in these things thing ready to go. Oh, I, and one thing I did want to mention too, I did get these torqued down to the proper torque value. And again, I did reference my exploded charts that I have here. Um, so yeah, um, we'll see what kind of progress I make today. Hopefully it should be a lot. I just, looks like my memory card might be filling up too as well. But uh, I'm really looking forward to the progress that I get done today. Okay.